What's going on guys? Kooks46 here bringing you another MLB The Show 17 pack opening. It has been a week since we opened up packs. Last time we did one was last Friday and we did pull Diamond Buster Posey so hopefully we can get another diamond today. But it is not going to be any ordinary pack opening. This is going to be the first DLC pack opening of the year. I guess it's not really DLC, but it's new packs into the game for a limited amount of time. They usually drop these every Friday or so. So finally, we got our first ones for MLB The Show 17, and it is the Bases Loaded Pack. So basically, these packs cost 4,000 stubs per pack, and you can only buy four of them through their span on the market. So in this pack, you're going to have four player items. You are guaranteed a single player. You have double the chance of a gold player and triple the chance of a diamond player. So that's pretty solid odds right there, guys. We know the diamond odds are already small as it is, but tripling them, they're still going to be small. This is not guaranteeing you a diamond or anything like that, but it gives you a better chance. Now, here's a little excerpt from the Show Nation on the blog. They're talking about the Bases Loaded Pack, and it says, Now let's talk long-term plans for the Bases Loaded Pack. This pack will stay in the sh uh, show shop and refresh weekly with a recurring theme around single, double, and triple. Next week, it may guarantee a single legend player item, double the, for the chance of flashbacks, and triple the chance for gold equipment items. We will continue to mix these up. The bases loaded pack has a purchase limit and expires once the countdown timer ends. So I already bought four of them. We're just going to get right into them. We're, we got to do it on Friday. You know what it is. The pack hype is there. So we got four bases loaded packs, and we also got a 10 pack bundle to rip into. So guys, we're going to be hoping for a diamond today. If you wouldn't mind, please drop a like on this video. The more likes this video gets, the higher chance we get of getting a diamond card. So what we're going to do is we're going to open up a bases loaded pack first, and then we're going to get into our toppers. And then we're going to open up another bases loaded. My volume is up on the TV. And we didn't get a diamond here. We got a silver, though. So we got John Jaso, James Shields, uh, Martin Perez, and Michael Franco. All right, he is our gold, is or our silver, I'm sorry, his inside edge is down. But, oh well. All right, now let's open up the topper here for the 10-pack bundle. And it is Joaquin Benoit. All right, two silver cards with inside edge down. <laughs> All right, let's go into the next bases loaded pack. Come on, give me that diamond. Give me that triple chance for the diamond. Ooh, we got Tony Watson. We got Breakout Danny Farquhar. I already have one of them. Jim Johnson and Odubel Herrera. All right, so we got three silvers out of that pack. Really not bad at all, actually. All right, now we're going to go ahead and do five of these set one standard packs. So hopefully we can get one of those rookie David Wrights, one of those... Uh, uh, Roberto Alomar is in there. Not in this one. Only got bronze. We got Sean Rodriguez. Uh, Brett Anderson. Okay. Open up some more. Let me know what you guys think of the pack opening in the comments down below. Do you guys think you're going to spend your uh, stubs on these packs? They are 4,000, but you can't buy more than four. So you're, you're, the total you can spend on these is 16,000 stubs if you're willing to spend them. Uh, okay. So the first three set one standard packs, nothing going, guys. Nothing. We got a gold equipment though, alright, maybe I'll be able to sell that for a little bit, and a silver player, James Paxson, nice, nice, getting those Seattle players, alright, one more pack here, and then we're going to open up another bases loaded pack, silver equipment, and nothing but garbage, actually Jake Deegan's pretty solid, he's really good for the event, if you guys have not been playing in the event yet, alright, here we go, bases loaded pack, let's open it up, we're going to have one left after this, but come on, give me one of those good cards, oh, another silver, what do we get? 84 cargo live series cargo is actually really solid. He is really good guys lefty uh, good power live series cargo is not a bad pull All right, let's keep going into these packs guys keep going more bronzes No gold players yet for us Unfortunate, but we still got packs. It's not over yet. Not over yet. Ooh, Yikes, these are rough guys <laughs> ref Snyder a bunch of commons RIP Let's see here Two silver equipments, or one of them is a sponsorship, and more silvers, or more bronzes, dude. We got Justin Wilson, I already have him, so I am getting some duplicates, which I can sell for a little bit of stubs, which is okay. And nothing. Oh, we got a silver. We got Joe Blanton. Okay, I'll take it. All right, last standard pack, and then we're going to go into the last bases loaded pack. Come on, give me something. Please, MLB gods. Please. Ooh. Nothing in the standard packs. It comes down to the bases loaded pack, guys. Are we going to be able to make some magic happen? Let's find out. Here we go. Last pack. Come on. Ooh, just a silver. Jake Odorizzi. All right, so we did not get any gold players. Kind of unfortunate, but that's what happens when you open packs, man. 
But anyway, guys, let me know what you thought of the pack opening down in the comments. Are you going to buy these packs? Are you going to save your stubs? Are you just going to work the market? Let me know in the comments. And guys, that's all I have for you today, so I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you know what to do. Hit the like button down underneath this video. Make sure you subscribe so you never miss any more MLB The Show 17 pack openings. And guys, that's all I have for you today, so I hope you enjoyed it. And until the next video, I will see you later.